set up on a maple tree just outside of one of our food plots. This is an afternoon hunt. We have a mature buck that has showed up twice here in daylight during hunting season. So I'm hoping I can get a shot on him. It's our first big cold front of the season. It's still a little bit hot though because it is Tennessee. So I'm really, really excited. And hopefully we can see some deer and hopefully we get a shot at this really mature buck. Well, that was the extent of my hunt. A lesson is learned every single time. Sadly, I did not get to see that buck, but I did learn that next year I'm gonna have to blaze a trail so I don't have to worry about deer smelling my access trail. After reflecting over the situation, I believe that it had to have been my access. There's a possibility that the wind might have drifted down. I think it's more probable that the access is the reason why the deer could smell me, but anyways, guys, just try and be careful out there. Make sure you spray down and make sure that your boots don't smell bad and try and not leave any scent on brush, leaves, or twigs, and you should be good. Anyways, stay tuned for next week's video, and if you're new, please subscribe. I appreciate it a lot, and I'll see you guys next time.